Have you ever been told to think big? A lot of people have, but then they find the hard reality that when you think big, not everything is as easy as you may have expected. Hi, my name is Mike Pettigrew. I'm a best-selling author and serial entrepreneur since 1987, and I help ordinary people to achieve extraordinary goals, but probably not in the way you might think. A lot of people, they set big goals only to find that things are not easy. They, they find they hit all sorts of setbacks and that makes you, can really make you disillusioned and disempowered. And in many cases, people reach the point where they think, what's the point in even setting a goal if I can't achieve it? And they give up and they end up just settling for a dissatisfying sense of mediocrity. I've seen this again and again in the lives of young people. In their late teens and early 20s, they've all these amazing, exciting ideas and plans for the future. And they have big plans, big goals. But then by the time they reach their 30s, they've often had so many painful experiences, so many setbacks, and they've discovered that not everything is as easy as they had thought. And that's at that point, the sad reality, that point, so many people d close down their realm of possibility. They give up and they just settle for second best. This is so sad. This does not have to be you. So wh what's the solution? Well, if you're finding this video of interest, if you want to get ahead to your next level of success, abundance and wealth, check out my Ultimate Success Club at achievegoalsfast.com forward slash USC. So what's the solution? Thinking big. Well, you know what? The solution is to think big, but act small. Think big, but, but act small. Now, what does that mean? Well, the first step in achieving anything substantial is to become really clear on what you want. Write down on a piece of paper, do a goal brainstorming session, write down on a piece of paper the things that you'd love to achieve your, during your life at some point. You can later cross off any that aren't that important, that that's your first starting point. That's your starting point, becoming clear on what you want. Then, of course, you break down each goal down to action steps, at least the action steps that you know you need to make, just even if it's only a few. The, others will be the other action steps will become apparent as you move and progress towards your goal. But you know what? Everything deter is determined on baby steps, small action steps, not running ahead at a million miles an hour because most people who try that, who try to do all sorts of things to achieve their goal really fast, are hit by so many setbacks. It's far better to make small, consistent actions. The reason this works is because when you achieve a small goal, you make one small action and it goes okay, then you gain a bit of confidence. And then as you keep making more actions and start seeing more results, your confidence grows. Everything builds from that. Everything. Even the greatest building created in history, the pyramids, started with a single block and then another and another. It, it didn't suddenly appear like that. So everything is, is cumulative. It's cumulative. And the same in building a better life. It won't happen instantly, unfortunately. There is some level of hard work involved, but it's often a lot easier than people may imagine. I'm a firm believer in the expression, minimum effort, maximum result. Minimum effort, maximum result. And this is what I teach in the Ultimate Success Club every single month. I go live for people all around the world and I teach the success habits, tools, strategies and techniques that have been scientifically proved to work. Most people do the same thing again and again, trying to, you know, hoping for a different result. And as Albert Einstein said, that's the definition of insanity. Or they, you know, they try this and they try that and all trial and error. And in most cases, that doesn't amount, amount to much either. But what if you could use a system that's been scientifically proved to work that definitely will give you results? Very simple, clear techniques that have worked for thousands of people around the world. In my opinion, that's much more sensible. If you want to achieve extraordinary levels of success, you need to copy what extraordinarily successful people have done. And every month I teach the principles that highly successful people all around the world used 
to achieve success. The other option is just hoping for a better life. But you know what? Most people's lives just become more of the same. Unless you start doing something different, one year from now, nothing much will have changed. So in summary, if you want to achieve a far better life, everything starts with thinking big and acting small. So thank you so much for watching and I hope you've enjoyed this video. Uh, please give it a like or share it with your friends if you feel they'll benefit from it. Thanks so much for watching and I look forward to speaking with you again very soon. Bye bye.